So this is a bit of a different video in quite a few respects. One, it's not actually going to be about survival or anything. <coughs> Two, this is being filmed on my f new phone. And three, I can't actually see myself, so I don't even know if I'm in shot or not. Because as you know, or as you may not know, this is what I normally use. And obviously I can turn this and see myself. And now you should be able to see what I'm using now. Because what I've been thinking is See this I wouldn't this isn't massive, but obviously a phone is a lot smaller. And I'm always got I've always got the phone on me, but I haven't always got the camcorder. So I if I figure out some ways of uh using different mounts for actually putting on tripods and stuff, <clears throat> then I'm gonna try and use my phone a bit more. The thing was I don't like holding a phone like this, trying to film, and obviously, as it is, you can't just put it on a tripod. So, I'd got one of these selfie stick things, you know, and you put that in there, and you can take these off, and then, I'll just turn this around a bit so you can see, you see the normal tripod there and then you can put it on a normal tripod so that's good on the normal tripod but it still means if you're filming I mean you've got to hold it like this or you could have it on a selfie stick but I found, so you see this different sizes, like. This was the smallest selfie stick I could find, which isn't really kind of pocket friendly, you know, it's still going to stick out massively. So that would mean I'd have to disregard the selfie stick and hold the phone again which I hate doing, hold the phone like this to film. And if you're doing something with your hand, you know, I don't like doing that. So what I did, I made this. Now what it is, is it's a different selfie stick. It's the bottom of one. So what I did was I cut the bottom of it. I'll tell you what, it took a bit of cutting. I tried to use a pipe cutter, but that just didn't seem to work. So I kind of ended up getting it off and it's kind of a bit like that, but it has got the threaded part at the bottom. So now what I can do, and it's got the mount part on it, so what I can do now is I can stick that phone in there like this, hold it like this and film. And to me, that's ten times easier as a handle. It doesn't move or anything, but I can hold that like that perfect. And then... If I have got a tripod on me, because it's got this on the bottom, it will. Just, what I'm trying to do is replicate the feel of my camcorder. And then I can put that on there and use it for filming. Because you see, as you know, with a camcorder, you just stick your hand in. It's easy. You don't really have to do nothing at all. But with... A normal phone you've got to hold it tight you know with the uh, camcorder I'll just stick it on here so now with this I should and it's got a lanyard I should just be able to you know press the button film what I need to film then if it comes to a shot where I need to be in it or both hands I'll stick that on there 
and then carry on filming like that. So that's a couple of ideas if you want to make something like that, or if you're not too bothered about having something slightly long, like I said, the selfie stick would do it. But you see, once this is like this, it's kind of not very, it's all right, but it's not very portable. So you could do the same thing, but you've got a lot sticking out, you know, and it doesn't go much smaller than that. Now that's a couple of ideas if you want to use your phone for filming. And like I said, obviously these, that is on a tripod at the minute, so these will go on a tripod. There was something else I got as well. I did get a little mini, a little mini tripod, which was about the same size as this handle. But, obviously being a tripod, I couldn't put that tripod then on top of this tripod. It would only be right down here on the floor, you know, so that was kind of irrelevant. Actually like this. See this tripod. It would create a similar thing. To, you know, it's up to you. You could use something like this. This would create the same thing. Hold it, film. But this will not go on here. So then I have to take this off again. Take it off of there. Put it on there. Which is not too much trouble, but that's not what I wanted. So... That's in there, filming, stick it on there, carry on filming. All right, that's pretty much it. I will show you another thing I got. I did get this for my normal camera, which is a LED light. I had to buy a special mount for this though. And this goes in here. Some of you would know I got this if you follow me on Facebook. Slots in there, and then I've got a light on top of the camcorder, so this might help a bit as well. And it should have a dimmer switch. What I notice, oh, it does a bit, but it's not perfect. Sometimes it seems to work, sometimes it doesn't. Anyway. Thought I'd show you those things. I know some people seem to be interested in it. So, right, cheers for watching. I'll see you later.